Okay, Mongoose Mike here. I'm going to do a quick walk around of this brand new Mongoose 184 sewer jetter built by Sewer Equipment out of Dixon, Illinois. That's right, made in America. The 184 stands for 18 gallons a minute, 4,000 PSI. And this uh, is our heavy duty version of the 184. We also have a 184 LT, which stands for light. Uh, this is the uh, Mac Daddy. This is the this is the uh, military Humvee of jetters, is what I tell people. So um, it's powered by a 49 horsepower Kohler turbo diesel. As you can see, the shroud is aluminum, easily removable. It's got that sweet mongoose logo cut in it. This diesel engine, this turbo diesel, is the quietest diesel in its class. It's got the best warranty in its class, and it is the most efficient. So you're using the least amount of diesel fuel for the most RPMs and horsepower. Okay, right from the start, uh, all these trailers are built in our facility in Dixon, Illinois. We don't buy trailers and put jetters on them. We actually build the trailers in our facility. Start off with a heavy duty cast iron bulldog hitch. Uh, most heavy duty hitch in the industry is why we use it. None of that thin walled steel stuff that gets all bent and mangled up that you have to replace every year or two. Also, all of our trailer tubes are enclosed. We don't put plastic tubes in the end that allow moisture to seep in and rust from the inside out. Ours are fully welded and enclosed tubes. U-door pump, again, 18 gallons a minute, 4,000 PSI. It's got your uh, pulsation valves, your air purge system. So you can literally blow all the water lines in this, this jetter completely dry if you wish. But it also has an antifreeze winterization system uh, that you can winterize this jetter in about 90 seconds. Um, then, of course, uh, when you're ready to jet, you just switch your valves, put some water in it, turn it on, and there is a return to antifreeze valve uh, back by the hose reel. You push your antifreeze back into the reservoir so that you can use it multiple times. You can see this one's got an eighth inch and a quarter inch uh, mini reel attachments on the front. These lift off, you just carry these right to your clean out. Your half inch jetter hose attaches right there. These you just pop off, you unlock them and carry them into uh, the house or whatever building you're jetting in or wherever you're using them. You can also get a 3 8 um, hose cart. It's 200 feet of hose. These have 100 feet of piranha hose on them. The 3 8 hose cart comes with 200 feet of 3 8 hose. And since that's a little bit more heavy to carry around, that actually comes on a wheeled cart and that can be mounted right here. And if we were to do that on this one, this mini reel would then be mounted uh, on the other side. And if this, if you ordered it with two toolboxes, it would just mount to the top of one of the toolboxes. This particular unit has a garden hose fill system. That's a hundred feet of garden hose there, five eighths inch, and it's plumbed straight into the tank. That's optional. The unit comes standard with a fire hydrant hose fill system, which you can see there. It also has an adapter, so if, if you didn't get the garden hose, you got an adapter here and you would bring your own garden hose if that's the way you're going to fill it and just attach it right to that. It does come with the fire hydrant hose and, of course, the, uh, the bracket to hold the, the hose in when you travel. It comes standard with one front opening aluminum toolbox, okay, as you can see. Accessories on the inside, you got a tiger tail. You get your sled. Uh, anytime you're jetting in 10 inch pipe or bigger, you want to put a sled on so your jetter hose doesn't flip over on you. Comes with a couple standard nozzles, a penetrator, a flusher. It also comes with this warthog. It comes with the warthog service kit. And you can also see there's a dump gun in there. That's not standard equipment, but for a few hundred bucks, it's a really, really nice uh option that you can get you just attach that dump gun straight onto your 500 feet of jetter hose great for cleaning up driveways after you've done a dig or cleaning off pumps that are down in a pit so you don't have to get down in there cleaning out around manhole coverage just got a plethora of uses um, nice for cleaning up other equipment anything else so you basically have a that i believe that that dump gun can handle eight gallons a minute at up to four or five thousand psi or something crazy so that's a tremendous amount of power for pressure washing the sewer equipment 
trademark hose reel. This is a one piece hose reel. We don't bolt our hose reels together. It's one piece. It's thicker than any in the industry, super heavy. It's really heavy duty. It comes standard with 500 feet of half inch hose. You can get 600 if you wish. Um, and as you can see, it's on a 7,500 pound swivel bearing, but I'm literally turning this with one finger. This thing turns nice and easy. And that swivel bearing is uh, super heavy duty. Uh, like I said, uh, 7,500 pounds, and uh, we're not putting near that much weight on it. As you can see at the bottom here, you got your return to antifreeze tank and your recirculation. That's a three-way valve, so you can recirculate anytime you want. This jetter can be controlled right here at the uh, control center. You can see the digital panel. I've got the key on. It shows you your water pressure, engine hours, your engine RPM. And there's, uh, you can throttle up and throttle down with your arrows here, or you can just switch it to uh, pressure sensor and you hit pressure up, it goes to 1,000, then to 2,000, then to 3,000, then to 4,000. So you don't have to sit there with the throttle and try to balance it out. You just hit it and it goes to, to the desired pressure. When operating here at the control panel, you also have control of your pay in and pay out for your hose reel um, with the joystick here and also your flow control so you can control the speed of your hose reel. You can slow it down to probably slower than you could ever want at almost a standstill and then speed it up to probably faster than you'll ever need it. It also has a hydraulic bypass so you can just bypass the hydraulics there and then freewheel it. So if you want to just pull off a few feet of hose without having to start your jetter, no problem. Mongoose also sports the best remote control in the industry. Um, this remote control has a line of sight range of about five eighths of a mile. Why is that important? Because you're never going to be that far away from your jetter. It's important because you can go into a basement or even a sub basement or inside uh, commercial settings around the back of a house, hundreds of feet from your jetter, and you don't have to worry about losing control of your jetter. Okay, and with that remote control, you also have full control of your hose reel in and hose reel out. A lot of remote controls do not have that feature. Um, in fact, our 184 LT version, that's the only operational difference is that you don't have control of that hose reel with the remote, but you do have the same joystick right there. So with the remote control in this unit, you have control of your pressure up, pressure down, water jet on, water jet off, hose reel in, hose reel out, and of course it's got an emergency stop button, which in my opinion is the most important feature on the remote control, because whoever's controlling the jetter can hit the kill switch and it just shuts the jetter down instantly. As you can see, it also has the three aluminum tanks. The far tank is your fuel, the center tank is your antifreeze, and the smaller near tank is your hydraulic fluid. All right. Other options that you can get with this jetter is an XL version, which is a twin axle twin tank. Uh, so you can have 600 gallons instead of 300 gallons. Of course, our tanks are black 300 gallon poly. No white tanks for us. They don't, black tanks don't let the sunlight through. So you don't have to worry about algae growing inside of your, your water tanks. Other options you can get, like I mentioned, a second toolbox. You can get an arrow stick. You can get an LED floodlight that mounts right here. It's about four inches round and bright enough to light up a football field. Great for if you do a lot of night jetting. Any questions, please call me 815-677-5106. I'd be glad to get a demo set up for you. Or if you want a quote, we can talk about options and uh, get you in the right machine for you. Thank you.